right, from the Dewey Decimal System to online databases, libraries are always changing with the time. Now students at UNO are using the latest and greatest innovations to help them make the grade. New at 6, KETV News Watch 7's Jeremy Maskell takes us inside the Creative Production Lab. All we do is press go. This laser printer is one of the newest items in UNO's library. It's cutting through right now. You can see there's a little bit of spark and flame with it. It's just part of the new creative production lab filled with cutting edge technology. The laser printer can create just about anything on acrylic, metal, or even wood. And, and you can see the level of detail. 3D printers let students make props or prototypes for their assignments. We've had engineering students come in and they've created UNO buildings and then have printed them for classes. He was able to design it in class and then see it in real life. It's giving students real experience and professors more options. This might be uh, a a way to connect with a university in Islamabad, Pakistan. Political so, science professor Patrick McNamara is already using this 120 inch screen and surround sound for class. And it is literally like being in the same room with those uh, students in Pakistan at our sister university. Not only is it making us better professors, but it's making our students more employable. What if you left for two years? Sierra Watson is fine tuning her voice for radio class in the new sound booth. It just kind of gives me the extra experience that I need. It is lab experience like this shaping the next class of graduates. The actual programs and the actual process of designing and the understanding of it, I think, is something that you can carry on into uh, the professional field. Jeremy Maskell, KETV, Newswatch 7. Anyone can use the lab, though students and faculty projects will likely get priority. Everyone will have to pay for the materials used. Some models on the 3D printer cost just a few dollars. Grants and student fees are paying for the equipment.